Are we good? We're live. Hey everybody, it's Erin Reed from Critivation 2024 and we are in the Prima booth. I'm so excited. Prima has not been at this conference in four years. Four years. Four years. And I saw their booth, I saw their list on there, I was like, oh, yes! This is like the best day ever. So let's go through. This is Sharon. We're going to go around and we're going to go look at all the amazing things that are in this booth and including a super sneak peek. Yes. Just for you guys. We're back to the old days where uh, you actually got your peaks at the show. We have one for you. Yes. All right, let's go. <laughs> all right, where are we are going to start over? I love this little, like the shutters. It's so, oh, it's so you guys. It's okay. so on brand. I yeah, so postcards from Paradise is by the Three Girls Tale. And it's. Oh, you're going to hold that? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. I can hold that. Yeah, great, I great. love it. You want to clip it yourself? You can do that. It's okay. I'll hold it. <laughs> um, so it's like the the wonderful story of three design team members who got together and created the three girls tale that's so they've had a couple collections and we brought products that we're demoing so we obviously we can't bring everything so that's postcards from paradise and we put in some of our redesign transfers that kind of fit that whole tropical. so for those that don't know what redesign is within yes. Prima, what is that it is our diy line it is created for furniture or home decor but we cross over all the time as creatives, right? Right. So Absolutely. they're furniture grade uh, transfers. Very but cool. So on furniture, what about walls? What about? Absolutely. Okay. Anything. They're, and they're high quality. They can be sealed, but they were made for furniture and walls. So you, you're going to see. And home decor items. Yeah. You know, anything. Oh, love it. Charcuterie boards and everything. Is it food safe once it gone? Has you do on? need to seal them. Okay. Okay. Because you don't want to be washing them and stuff. And then they come off. And yeah, off. they okay. could. Cool. I love yeah. that. Yeah. Very pretty. Okay. And, and then moving over here, we have in full bloom. That was the Three Girls Tale latest. And um, there's just fun, oh, that's sealed. fun colors. Too. And then we have some Frank Garcia stuff and some of our molds from Lost in Wonderland, which are coming back in stock shortly. Yay. I love Frank's stamp oh, right there. That. He has some really fun products. I know you guys that is know such a his beautiful brand. project. I love that one. Projects are by Natalie and Shannon. They're really cool. And what do we have down here at the bottom? Art Philosophy is our art line. I know Prima has so much. So a lot of watercolors, we found that a lot of people like to add color on some of their projects. Maybe they're cards, maybe they're mixed media. So these are confection sets and if you look at them they open up like a box of chocolates <laughs> they have little wells to mix and they pop out and they're just sorry there we oh, go you're fine you're fine multiple sets so um really fun and if you're at the show come over and play with us we're working with tags that um it's just fun they all work together and that's one thing i think redesign prima and art philosophy all work together very cool. Do you want to do the sneak peek? Yes. I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh my goodness. Nature, like academia collection. Oh my goodness. I totally screwed that up. Okay, let me do this again. The nature academia collection. Yeah, that's better. Late April. <laughs> Late April. Oh my gosh, look. Look at the tones on this. Oh my goodness. Look at the little frog. Oh. So it will come with a collection pad and you're going to get a bonus cutout sheet, uh, which is what this sheet was right here. Sorry. Oh, that... And the, the collection is right behind it. It will come like that. Look at that. It's so magical. It's, oh, look at this. Oh my god. There goodness. is a mold and a four by six paper pad as well that we don't have here with us, but and lots of embellishments on that ring over there. It is a dark, the darker lines are really popular right now. Yes. They are so, look, there's that typewriter again. Man, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. It's like a once upon a time with a little bit of some whimsy, with a little bit of science. Oh, I love this. Like apothecary, but not. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. That Encyclopedia Britannica look. Your flowers are second to none. I've always loved your flowers. Thank They're just you. so beautiful. We actually have flower designers who do, they sit and work on flower designs. We pick kind of the best to bring to market. Yeah, I mean, 
They're beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you. Um, so we're moving over into like the redesign and that is our DIY for home decor, furniture. A lot of them cross over into mixed media though. So we have small transfers. There's three sheets in each one, six by 12. Those were made by Jody Lee for us. They are They're little so flower children. So and you so might have seen some of them in a paper collection, something similar. Yes. Um, but you can see those. Digging all the fruit. I'm beautiful lately. for like kitchen boards yes. and different things like I'm that. Loving it. Can you guys? Can you see it on the? Is a reflection there? Let's and if you want to flip through this, Aaron, okay. there's a ton. Flip. Ready? Okay. So this is just icing on the cake. Here we go. These are I'm all the it. small transfers. They come with three different sheets, and each sheet is different in there. So you can there. see on the back side, there's yes. stuff here. I'm going to keep going. <gasps> These, literally, you pull off the back, you set it down. It comes with its own transfer stick. Are these the same ones? Yeah. Rub it on, and then peel that top layer off. Oh, my goodness. And if you're doing them on furniture or cabinets or walls, you want to seal them if you're going to be touching them a lot but oh, on look at the idea right there that's such a cute idea paper crafts and things you don't need to seal them. no wow. look at oh, that's so and we stunning. didn't even bring all of them we just have just a few that you brought oh, oh that's Ooh, cool I like that. that is cool there's something for everyone in there isn't there it's such a fun oh, way to do rare birds look at the colors on oh, that that's exactly what <laughs> Love those colors. Oh. The panda. Oh. So I thought he was playing a flute. No, no. He's eating bamboo. He's eating bamboo. But but he's holding it like a flute. Exactly. And he's actually holding it the right way. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. That's our flute playing panda. Flute playing panda. All right, H2O transfers go on with water. Similar concept to peel off the back, set it down, add water on top, and it will transfer. The the reason these are so cool is because you can put them on like candles, uh, glass. Oh, look at that. Mm, yeah. There are samples on the left um, with the candles and wood, and you can see they'll go on things that regular transfers won't. Right. Because the so, water will have a transfer over. Yeah. How much rubbing is involved to get it to stay on? With there? those, yeah. hardly any. Okay. You just dab it with a wet sponge or a water so brush. It's more like a tattoo kind it of thing. It is. Idea. It could be like a tattoo. Perfect. <laughs> Like That's a giant temporary tattoo. Is that what you just said? <laughs> yes. We're thinking of like. Yes. And, and then we have mid size transfers on the bottom. Those are eight and a half by 11. And you get three sheets in there. Again, there's a lot. You can build bigger designs. You can use the smaller oh, yeah. ones. That's my favorite. Love that orange. That's cool. And I like that you're giving, like, I'm just noticing the nice big tool to help. That's yeah. the transfer stick, yeah. and yeah, it will help you put it on. It's not this little dinky thing. It's no, nice it's not. It. It's not a popsicle stick. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's that's. And I yep. love that you do the samples. And the chalk paste. These are thick, matte, painted or colored paste. So Finnevere has glimmery, shimmery ones. These are matte, um, and they come with the inside seal to keep them fresher longer. They're wonderful on stencils. There's a whole slew of colors. But There's, you get the oh, idea. We brought 30 colors with us. And here's some more here. You can see all the beautiful colors. You can also thin them down a little and use it to paint things that you want to have a matte finish. Um, and then decoupage paper, it was created for furniture, but we've been making tags with them. They're a very thick. You can pull oh, this exactly. one out and oh i was thinking it was more like tissue paper it is no. not like rice paper or tissue that's it's cool. it kind of feels like a dryer sheet that's what i was thinking right yes, it feels like a dryer sheet yeah. so you can reposition this it's not going to tear when you put it on your yeah, adhesive got... yes hey that's not tissue sure paper yeah, sure they're paper. great for um junk journals that's anything not break. that's cool and i'm sure the cutting out it makes it easier because it's not going to rip and yeah. tear so it's exactly it does very nice very cool. That's neat. And like the, we have tons of designs. If you want to flip through, there's single packs through. and triple packs. Look at that. Oh, love those. <laughs> oh my They're goodness. Lovely. Look at this. Oh, I love the inside of the drawers. Yeah. That is so cool. 
So you're using with the, with the decoupage gel to seal it and to add it to if, it, right? If you're going to put it on furniture, use the decoupage gel and put like a thin layer mm -hmm. and then add your paper and oh. put another layer on top. I know. Oh my goodness. If you're doing paper crafts, you literally can just do a thin coat of right. the decoupage gel, which comes in matte and shine. Oh my god. Elaine, that's my mom's name. <laughs> the dark ones, oh my gosh, we sell so many. so pretty. I mean, just look at like being able to repurpose old furniture. Mm -hmm. So I live not too far from Round Top in Texas, where you can go like junking yes. and just finding all that yeah. stuff. And finding all those old pieces or going to Salvation Army or Goodwill and finding that stuff and then pretty good stuff and we're getting out of the I mean you can use it for scrap you can use it for paper crafts yeah. you can do that but it's definitely home decor so obviously prima.com but Amazon or where else can we find these like look, kinds of products I would look on redesignwithprima.com okay. because we have our our retailers listed there that carry redesign okay yeah very cool all right um, so what do we got so down here Katja is one of our designers and she loves gold can you tell this is her imitation gold leaf which comes in 25 sheets in the pack she puts it on with gilding glue and oh my gosh, it's pure gold. That's like wedged in there. But like, what yeah. does the sheet look like? Can I? It is a very, it's just thin, a very thin, almost like yeah. a like a film. Yeah, that's yeah. the word I was thinking. They're they're um very like a foil. I guess is the best way I was thinking. Like it that. is, yeah. but it's not going to be thick. It's going to be thin, so you get a beautiful effect. Is this, this? You, so you use the gilding glue, spread that out on on say a canvas, and then lay the sheets on top. Um, and the, it, the gilding glue has directions. It's got to get tacky. Okay. You put it on top and use like a, a soft brush to brush off the excess. So is that what this is? So we've add, she's added it to specific places. That is not. Oh, that's not. That's, that's just another else. gold option. Oh. This, this one has the gold leaf. That's what this is. Yes. Very so cool. we did a, a, we did a casting in our mold and we did this one for New Orleans. And so this is on black. And then here we have it on white. We used the black glaze, and then we took the gilding marker and went around. It's very oh, precise. What's this one? Yeah, Natalie's here, and she. Look at that! I'm loving the back. Okay, cool. fine people. We've. It's okay. We got like a couple more minutes. We'll finish. We'll finish. Is that okay? Okay. <laughs> they can still hear us over so the mic. So okay. For so then we have our molds, decor molds. Oh, so that's what we were doing. Thank you to Mike Glimmer for entertaining us on the piano this afternoon. Us, that's pretty darn loud. Yeah. I hope you'll all be joining us at the President's saying, reception so tonight, that as is you know. Right above us, and God knows how loud. That was painful. Can you hear me? As you know, the President's reception is so always a rollicking good time. They so I hope you'll be with awesome. us. So the molds that we have like here. Transportation starts at yeah. 6.30 So we use casting resin in that mold. And then paint them and add the gilding marker on. or the decor so, wax. So can they start paint them with, yes. Yes. Paint them with that. Yeah. That, yeah. yeah. This one's shimmery. And oh, now yeah. it's official. These have been... The molds have been a bestseller. I think the, the economy, closed. people can, you can use hot glue in them. Yes, I've seen that. That is, we did that as a demo. We have, we've been doing them over here. Yes. Love that. And Please they are food safe and oven safe. That's awesome. sure do you have you one so I can show color. people how flexible they are? Yeah, do you have one with hot glue? And no, we'll like just the mold itself. Oh. oh, the mold. The mold. Look yes. at the hot glue one. Okay, check this out. Okay. Natalie's been doing that, it's very, so you're putting the mica powder in here. Look, this yeah. is going to make the prettiest. Talk, you know, it's okay. <laughs> Natalie's <laughs> French. You want to hear her talk. Oh. <laughs> She's, she Thank has you. the most beautiful accent. Yeah. She thinks she doesn't. I love it. Dust, dust the mica powder in there, any combination, and then put your hot glue on top. And look so at that. Pretty. And then what did you do, Natalie, for the gold? I, had, I added the gilding marker on the top to make all the details pop. Oh, so pretty. So look at that. Yeah. So fun. That's so much fun. And is it just the one, the gold? Do you have a silver? Is there a bronze? We only have gold. We just introduced that yeah, right I know. now. I'm in the same boat. Well, like, oh, stay tuned. Yes. Prima I'm doesn't just it. stop I'm with one. the future of these colors. <laughs> I'm going to give this back to you. <laughs> and then we have uh, Finnevere is starting down here with one oh. of our big molds. That Those are her rust paste just in action on that sheet.
a that furniture so artist cool. created that this last weekend so this from the Jonathan wow. flew in from the UK and was at an event and did that and then up here we have Finn's new waxes Ooh. so here they are on oh those are her 10 new ones that is awesome Look at how, how beautiful. beautiful that is. And just look at all coral, honey, acid, moss, green, sea glass. Oh my goodness, I'm seeing sparkles. Those are also oh. great. And with using molds and hot glue, you can dump a couple wow. in. So Michael, or you can do yeah. both. Yes, absolutely. So flakes. this is the finiver section. Yeah, metallic flakes. There's lots of different um, combos. And she named them after cities like uh, Dublin. Dublin? Okay, yeah, on right? One? Okay, here we go. Oh, this one's just sparkling, but okay, wait, wait. Barcelona. There okay, you go. Uh, okay, what do we got? We didn't We've bring got... them all. Oh. This one, this one is also <gasps> Paris. Of course. Oh, look at that. That, oh, that's so cool. I love that's that. That's kind of the whole booth. You got your mixed media, your redesign, your art philosophy, and I your paper. It. It's so much fun. Well, thank you. Thank you so much for You're having You're welcome. Me. We've gone back for years. I don't know. We, it's just, it's one of those things. And I've always loved Prima products. They never cease to just disappoint. I mean, they're not disappointing at all. There's always the most amazing new lines of things. And they bring in the, the best artists to create the products. So we have two projects. Best. If you want to look, we have, uh, oh. now this is where we were saying we get into home decor. We just came out with the Lazy Susan. Oh, that's fun. And that one uses that. the decoupage paper, a stencil. Remember the flakes? Right, right, right. The metallic flakes by Finnevair. And then resin poured on top. Oh. And over on that side, we have a brand new bisque vase that uses... Oh, the molds, the decor molds, the rust paste and patina paste, and then some waxes Let's on there. the texture on this. It's like, <laughs> you can't even buy it. Like it's, oh, it's like gritty and oh, fun. And, oh. One of our retailers made that. That is And so another cool. retailer made this that one. That is beautiful. Yeah. It is so beautiful. Thank you, Erin. Well, Thank you. Thank you guys for joining. But the show is officially closed for today. So we need to sign off because we are on to our next thing. So thank you, thank you again. And I know you guys are ready to go on to your next thing as We're well. Great. I don't want to hold thank you any longer. You. They're long days. So thank you, everybody. I am signing off. Goodbye. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye, everybody. <laughs> thank you.